Hi you guys, welcome back to my channel. I really appreciate you guys tuning in and watching another video and sticking it out with me. Thank you so much. Make sure you guys hit that subscribe button and right now to the subscribe button is going to have a notification bell and you hit the notification bell so that way every photo I upload you will definitely get on your phone. This is an empties video. Thank you so much for watching and let's get started. This is a Bath & Body Works empty haul and now also it is a product empty haul as well. Everything that I used up, um, I guess within a month, um, that's what I'm doing a haul on. So uh, let's get started. This is, excuse me, a deep cleansing hand soap called Afternoon Apple Picking and this is from Bath & Body Works. And I think this is a fall scent and this the notes are apple pear and cinnamon and you guys they have two different um hand soaps they have the deep cleansing hand soap and they have the foam hand soap and the deep cleansing hand soap is so soft you don't need like really no lotion or nothing like that but the foam hand soap you need lotion but i work in water maybe that's just me so my hands are like kind of always dry but this smells like I, we just just got done using this so i don't know what it smell like right now so i'm about to show you guys what it smell like okay it smell like cinnamon it got the apple in there and also it smell a little it smell like pears a little bit this is really cool um i will definitely repurchase this when the soap to be 2.95 and um yeah this is the one we have down downstairs in my kitchen we use up the kitchen soap more often than the bathroom soap which I got two bars of soaps. I got a bar of soap and I got the foaming hand soap in there. So they just used the bar of soap. So I don't understand why. And they got easy access to the foaming hand soap. I just want them to use it up. That's all. But yes, this smells so good. And I definitely will repurchase this. Um, yeah. So next up I used up was Mary Cherry Cheer. And this was in the body wash, you guys. And um, the notes are cherry, cider, and sugar must. And I love their body washes, but I want to go crazy on their body washes like my lotions. Because I'm not really like, I like soap better. So I would spend a lot of money on their lotions than body wash. That's just me. This have like a, um, the smell, do smell like sugar. It smells like a purple candy that... It smells like candy, but it's more like that purple candy that tastes so nasty. Like, I was drilling, like, I was like, sorry, not drilling. I was just, like, dwelling on not using this. Like, literally, like, it was, like, really killing me to just, like, oh, like, it's on my skin. Like, it don't smell as good. Like, oh, like, let me hurry up and just run through this. So, it took me about two weeks to get through this. And, you guys, I'm so happy I got through this. Because the smell is really not my favorite, but for 75% off, you can't beat it, right? So, I just was getting it just because. Um, next that we finally used up was this Vaseline. And it just looks like this. And it's empty. Um, it took us a long time to use up this Vaseline. A long time. But, Yeah. <laughs> Next up, we have Hello Beautiful and the shade and the um, body care lotion. And you guys, this smells like flowers. And let me read the, the notes. It's Blossom, Pink, Nectarine, and um, White Garnier. So, let's smell it. It smells like floral. And I have that fresh Flora smell for spring and summer too. It's very light. It's not really as strong, but it's very light. And I was just so happy to go through this. So yeah, I'm happy. That's up uh, one. As long as one lotion is is gone, that means I'm doing good, right? Okay. All right. I, I'm okay. <laughs> let's go to the next up. Let's go to the really. We're going to go to the aromatherapy. Okay. Aromatherapy, comfort vanilla. And you guys, this is the 
and this is the cream the cream of um this this vanilla line and i'm sorry it's a 24 hour moisture butter so you guys it smells like vanilla it got that vanilla slash african smell but not too much as the african smell it got that after that after smell the taste the smells like a look you know that little african smell i liked this at first but i'm like mm, i don't like it no more so i just moved on i just gave it basically start using on my kids so yeah and we finally ran through it and i had this for like three years would i repurchase this Mm, yes for my kids if it's 75 percent off and i definitely would not repurchase this because i'm over this scent so um yeah but i will definitely repurchase vaseline um i finally ran through the champagne toast um hand sanitizer and it's mixed with like glitter and stuff you guys and it was really cool it smells so good it got that for floral girl scent it smells like champagne toast, and it smells so good, you guys. And it got glitter, so I love glitter. So, yeah, I used it up, and so did people. So did so did the people at the job use it up, too. So, it's an antibacterial hand gel. So, I used that up. I have two, um, two hand sanitizer um, pocket bags handles on my keys and my clock in card. So, I try to use it up as much as possible. But I definitely will purchase that if it's on sale. I finally ran through a candle called Mango Matai. And you guys, it's it's smell burnt now because I burnt it, but and that's how it looked. It smells it do smell like mango. This this um candle is very strong. So like I said, the strong candles you cannot have them in a small room, you have to have them in a big room. For the throw can linger everywhere. Like do, do um light up the whole downstairs. So and it also lingers upstairs. So yeah, if you have it burning for too long, you definitely will smell it all through your house. So these candles are very strong and they are worth it. But I think I had got this candle for um ten fifty in the summertime and yeah, I like it. But would I repurchase? Yes, if it's on sale. And it smells just like a mango. But right now, it smells like a mango and burnt, f like, fire. Next up, I finally got through the Clorox Disinfectant Bathroom Cleaner. And you guys, I cannot stress, stress this enough. I love this bathroom cleaner. I use it up, like, constantly. I probably, I probably ran through a lot of them and didn't save them. But this is not my first empties for this. But this is my first empty for this video to show you guys. I found I used it up and I finally did. So um it works, it works miracles. I use this for everything. My kitchen counters, my bathroom, my stove, my refrigerator, my cabinets. Y'all, I use this for everything, and it works so good like it knock off a stain that you got on your stove like i got them old-fashioned stoves that's like you know they they catch all the scum and it's hard to like break off all i have to do is spray this on my stove and leave it on there for five minutes it will break all of that down and you guys this is the bomb trust me i use it for everything like everything next up i got through was the frozen lake hand soap and you guys this how it looks like a man scent it's like a more like a manly scent but it smells so good i don't know if like a a manly scent but a good manly scent you know oh it's, it smells so good like I can't explain it. It just smells like a man scent. Like, okay. It smells like degree. A man deodorant degree. The degree that the man's be wearing under their arm, this is what it smells like. It smells just like that, you guys. It smells so good. That's mainly a manly scent. I finally got through my ivory soap. Two packs of these. So I ran through two packs of soap. And I love my ivory soap. It changed my life. 
Um, I don't use Dove. I don't use nothing else besides the Bath & Body Works body wash and my ivory soap. You guys, it just keeps my pH balance on key. Like, I love this and I'm so happy that I found out about this because like this soap work and it's like one of them soaps that don't have no dye or none of that like i used to use iris spring but not anymore because the reason why i use iris spring a lot of guys be like oh why you use iris spring that's a man's soap because i'm used to it my mom used to buy it all the time so it was like something i was like used to and you know i got a custom to so it used to throw me off the iris springs throw me all the way off so I used to have like a lot of like yeast infections a lot because of Irish Spring, but didn't know that it was because of the soap. So I changed my soap and I changed it to Ivory. And you guys, um, I don't have those yeast anymore. And I'm so happy because some soaps can throw you off and that's not good. So you gotta find the right soap for you. That's gonna clean your body and that's going to not throw your pH balance off. I'm just being real. Next up I got was the 24-hour moisture body lotion. And this is the Snowy Morning. And this was last, last year packaging. And lotion, you guys, this lotion smells so good. It smells like a snow. Like, it smells like nice floors, like, like if the snow could smell this would be the scent like it smells so good like you could just go outside and let it just snow and smell it and it's like <sighs> like this is this is where it's at i'm so mad because i did not purchase a lot of these and i only purchased a little bit so and i don't like to order online so yeah i love this lotion it got that fresh winter Floral, but that fresh light, it smells so good, you guys. Like, this will make a person head turn. Like, wow, like, that smells so good. And I'm so mad that I'm out of it. You, y'all just don't know. I stock up on, like, I, if I knew that they was going to discontinue this, I was going to have at least about 12 of these, like, literally, because I need them in my life. But they didn't bring it out this year, which I, well, last year, because it's 2020 now, they didn't bring it out. So I was just like, I was really pissed. But yeah, whatever. They're going to come out with it one day. Um, Next up, we went through the soft tissue pocket pack 10 sheet of um, what Kleenex. But we didn't go through it. My son actually like found this and opened it up and I had Kleenex all over the floor so I guess you could say we ran through it but because my son got to it so yeah we ran through it so yeah I bought this um at the Dollar Tree and you guys nope I bought this at CVS for um they had like I think like a 10 pack I'm not sure I got a CVS haul and my videos and this what this came from and you guys it was only a dollar not just this it was like a huge pack and it was well worth it um elon went through the body wash i was spring and you guys it's deep action scrub and they have like little beads and stuff in here like for your body so it's like i don't know what you call it and you guys it feels so good. Like he say, it feels so good. But he be like, oh, it makes my, we all grown. I'm be honest. Am I going to be honest? <laughs> he say it make his balls feel cool. Okay. So if you want your man balls to feel cool, go right ahead. Okay. I mean, hey. <laughs> Okay, that's I hey, I'm just being real. What you want me to do? I mean, that's what he said, and then he like it. It cleans his body, and in the summertime, it makes his boss feel cool, and in the winter, his boss feel cool. So I don't, I don't know, but 
I don't know. I don't know. But, um, hey, whatever works for him, you know? Um, now I ran through the, I ran through the Mad About You 24-hour um, body cream. And you guys, they just had this back out. But I did not repurchase because... I'm, I'm trying to get rid of all the old scents and just trying to go into my new scents because I got a whole year worth of, a whole another year worth of lotions. So I'm trying to just get through all the old lotions and go towards my new lotions. So yeah, let's do the sniff test. And when I repurchase everything I just said, you guys, yes, okay. It smells floral. It's that floral spring summer smell it smell like something pink but that nice fresh pink smell oh uh -oh. it smells good it smells so good it smells very good you guys i finally ran through that yes okay yes um i ran through the cactus blossom and a thousand wishes wallflowers i just saved the packaging so I ran through that. Um, I don't keep my wildflowers because I just be so happy they are like they empty and I'm ready to change them and use up the wildflowers. So I <sighs> so I can't go shopping again. My New Year resolution was not to spend no money at Bath and Body Works. God, I got a problem. I got a problem, a huge problem. I'm sorry, y'all. My man just texted me, so he texted back and forth. Hold on. <laughs> okay, even though he downstairs, but I got a huge problem. So the next thing I ran through was the fresh sea salt mango. And you guys, this smells so good. Elon have a body wash that smells just like this. And you guys, it smells so good. It's that floral Hawaiian. Um summer spring fresh light scent and it smells so good you guys oh my god anything i recommend like if you into that fresh fruity a little fruity but not too fruity um clean light a little strong but not too strong summer spring smell i don't know if i said that all over again but i'm serious that's what I like. I don't like none of that. Um, I like fruit, but it's got to be like a nice fruit smell. I'm into stuff like a fresh smell, you know. So the stuff that I recommend is all fresh, girly scents, but not like too girly. It's got to have a little masculine in there, um, a little fresh, like a little like bathroom like air freshener that you cannot buy in a body body care. You know what I'm saying? I'm into stuff like that. Um, What else? How can I describe it? And yeah, like more like a summer nice smell. So I'm into stuff like that. I'm not really into floral. Okay, I guess somebody is playing in the, in the ice. I mean, our whole street is icy. So, I guess he playing in the ice. Long time running to my house. He'll be all right. But, yeah. um, Yeah, so, back what I was saying. Yeah, I like that. So, that's what I'm into. Um, That's the little top to my lotion. I ran through the Secret pH Balance Powder Fresh deodorant. And like, like I said, you guys, every time I review this, it changed my life completely. Like it changed my life to, it changed my life. Okay. We just going to say that it changed my life because my underarm pits totally changed on me. Like, I don't know. It just changed on me, but that works miracles. Um, I ran through the Wernerberry Wonder Moisturizing Body Wash. And you guys, this smells like I, I I never really tried this, but I gave it a try because I think it was like $4.95. So 
and it smells like a winter and it smells just like berries but it's more like a floral type of berry scent and it smells so good um and yeah it, it works wonders too and but i just found out i have to use this with a um a scrunchie like a what is this scrunchie what the fuck is this scrunchie though like god damn i need to do more videos okay excuse me it's like a sponge i don't know what it's called right now i can't i can't think it's a sponge that you clean your body with you know what i'm talking about and you guys this you have to use this on one of them you know washable sponge because a rag you will get the leather you want but you you it seemed like you won't do the job better in a rag um it would do the job better in a in a in a um in a sponge so if you're using something like a um, bath and body wash um shea butter cocoa butter moisturizing body wash definitely use it with the spongy and not with the rag i learned that today because right now i am working on um oh what is that in there frosted something so i'm working on that now so yeah and that is it for my empties video yes i put in that container because any other container but yeah um i want to talk to you guys a little bit about um like i'm gonna try to upload videos every friday again i work i have two boys and i'm in the process of trying to get married so i'm in the process of setting that up myself and um like setting up my my wedding and everything else so i don't have a wedding coordinator but i do have my bridesmaids and we are getting the bar rolling so i'm sorry if i haven't been posting as much but i'm trying to get a video out every friday i'm kids free every friday and um I, yeah i'm trying to get the bar rolling so i would love to record about my wedding but the things i pick out but i'm recording my phone so it's so hard to record on my phone um i gotta get my camera fixed i haven't got it fixed yet but getting a camera means i gotta get an editing program and you know whatever so i don't got time for that right now so i just keep doing it on my phone as much as possible um yeah um yeah, so if you guys haven't, just add me on Instagram. Um, my Instagram name is julia.p029. Um, so um, that's my Instagram name. I never really changed it. That's just basically like half of my email. Um, and then my Facebook name is Paulette Jean. So if you guys want to add me on there, add me. But I, I just post um, pictures and um you know, like little statuses and stuff. I'm all positive. Um, re rarely negative because I'm not negative. But sometimes we all get fed up, right? I'm just saying. But, you know, I try not to be... Well, I'm not going to be negative anymore because I, I, I made a negative post or whatever. But I, and I told myself, like, Paulette, like, I just try to test myself because I'm not that type of person. And it just made me feel so bitter. Like, it made me feel so, like... Ugh, you know, like I'm down in like other people and it's like, mm -mm, I'm not that type of person. So I'm never going to do that again. Um, so yeah. So thank you guys for watching my video and I really appreciate you guys so much and make sure you guys have a wonderful day and wait, do you guys like my direct? And it's so cute. I got it from the beauty supply. Any beauty supply. So these type of durags, you guys, I got this in blue, pink and um it's like a gold color so it's like that shimmer glitter and then on the back it's blue so this string i could like i could flip on both sides so one side is blue and then i could flip it to the glitter side you guys so that's really cute and the girl you know your girl gotta wear a durag for the braids because a scarf ain't cutting it i mean when i was growing up i was growing up with my brothers you know i wasn't hanging with my sister so they wear a durag. I'm wearing a durag. You know what I'm saying? So, anyways, make sure you guys have a wonderful uh, weekend and, well, a wonderful week because the weekend is over. And thank you guys so much for watching. Stay tuned. Bye.